Oh, Nigerians, busy, blind, and deaf. As the oppressors use ethnicity and religion to further misguard, confuse, and mesmerize the suffering but smiling Nigerians, they cooperate and protect each other's interests across ethnic and religious boundaries. Oh, Nigerians, busy, blind, and deaf. As we join the bandwagon to talk about democracy and your chicken shit transition, I like to ask, whose democracy? Whose transition? Because once the exploitation of the dishonest democracy of the rich is shot dead on the streets of Lagos, man's inhumanity to man shall cease. Oh, Nigerians busy, blind, and deaf. My neighborhood is infested with mushroom churches because suffering Nigerians want their miracle today, not tomorrow. So they are busy hopping and stepping around from one miracle center to another with the name of the Lord on their lips as their hearts and their deed are fathers removed from him. Now I want to ask you, who is fooling who? Oh, Nigerians busy, blind, and deaf. When the late predator and dictator finally kicked the basin, we hit the street. Yes, there was dancing in the street. There was celebration, jubilation, because we felt our tribulations were all over. And yet, a perfect new stranger came from behind. But they're still dancing in the street. Hip hop hooray. Mm? Oh, mm? hey, stop that break dancing. But I like to ask, what is all this celebration over the unknown new? Like little restless, ignorant youngsters, we have again confidently put our future, our hope, our trust in the unknown soldier. Oh, Nigerians busy, blind, and deaf. I want to ask you, has anything really changed? Why are the queues still at the pump station? Why are the pump stations still dry? Why is there no money in my pocket? Why is this shit system still the same? Why is Nepa still playing disco night fever with my life? Why are the famous bandits and rogues and thieves of this great country back again through the back door? All in the name of politics, but this is a new game. It's called politricking. Oh, Nigerians. Oh, blind, deaf Nigerians. Can you say you're too blind to see the handwriting on the wall? Can you say you're too deaf to hear the sound of your own requiem mass? Oh, Nigerian, busy, blind, and deaf. Now get the bloody camera off my face while you think about it.